What's up everybody out on Lake Chatoog with my guy YouTube sensation Ron Phillips <laughs> Literally the other day a guy goes hey, you're the dude that fishes with dream catchers So it's official Ron is a YouTube sensation a legend in his own mind in my, own in mind. my mind dang it, I love this guy anyways We're out on Chatoog today really excited to get after it gonna be kind of a big conglomeration Doing some cranking jerk baiting finesse fishing a little bit of everything. I'm expecting a big bag so stick with us, gonna be fun. Yep. Oh, you like a good one? Decent fit. Ooh, on the hill, jerk bait, jerk bait. Oh, spotty, skinny. Skinny fish. That a boy rock. And the celebratory parachute, whatever thing <laughs> that is. Oh boy. There he is. Got him? Yeah. Ooh, on the Mega Bass Edo Shiner. A little bit more of a magnum size jerk bait this one's had the dang paint beat off it by bigs but there you go it's two fish in what five minutes yep. three fish actually the one got off but there you go i literally threw that fish back and ron's got another one that's a little guy's gotta eat too there we go Big school of them right here. There, there he is. <sighs> Little fella. Unless he's swimming right at us. Oh, we come off. Got him? Way out there. Yeah. <laughs> he come off school. I landed it on his head way out there. I just reeled it down and paused it. It's a better one. Guy, there they are right there. Nice. That's the one thing I like about the Edo Shiner on Herring Lakes. It's real heavy. It's a heavy, heavy jerk bait. And uh, it's a little bigger than a plus one. It's about the same size as the plus one if you count the size of the lip, but a uh, little bit more magnum of a jerk bait. And like I said, you can see that thing has been wore out, but you can cast it far. And when they're schooling, you can make it happen. Got him. Right on top of the boat. Yeah, I was reeling it in. I was reeling it in, dude, and he freaking smoked it. He choked it good, too. God. Look at that. He freaking ate it to his booty. On the Ito Shina. <laughs> I guess the pliers. The pliers like it too, dude. They won't, they won't let go. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, they're on your jerk bait. Pause it, pause it. There he is. I'm telling you, dude. I was like, dude, you gotta pause it. You gotta pause it. Because <laughs> they were they were like, you were like ripping it away from them. A little bit nicer, I think. He's just meaner. Look. No, he's nicer. <laughs> that a boy, Rob. 
Dude, <laughs> did you see them on the pan optics? Yeah. They were going crazy behind it. I was like, oh my gosh, pause it. That's a good one, dude. Just swiping it. There he is. Got him. God, you're an animal, Rod. You're crushing him today, Bubba. That's a good one too, man. Oh yeah. I saw it. I saw him again, and I paused it just when I saw him chasing it like that. Oh, that's bigger than the last one. Yeah, dude. Oh, Rod, that's a good one. Let's go. Show the camera. Show the camera. Okay. Okay. Two and a half, two and three quarter. Probably. Nice, man. Way right. Oh, you went money. It looked like a dang, mine looked like a dang knuckleball. Got him? Yep. <laughs> Rod. Hey, who execu executed the accurate cast that time? Feel like a good one? Yeah, that I got a T-bone something. Something weird about it. Doesn't want to come up, it keeps digging down. Hey, sometimes there's some giant largemouth up in here too. It's a big fit. Oh no, not really. He's just He's fouled. He's fouled. Which means he doesn't count, right? I'm counting it. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. <laughs> and they just swipe at it, then they you don't know where they're gonna get a hook in them. No. Nope. Yeah, look at him in the back. <clears throat> There's one. There we go. In the jerk bait. Oh my gosh. Catfish? Yep. No. No, it is a bass. It looked like a catfish at I first. It was a catfish there for me. Well, that's another nice one. Yeah, that's a nice one. Dude, they're up there in the dirt eating those bait fish. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a healthy one right yeah. there, bro. That would, that, would, that would definitely help in our best five. No doubt. Yeah, good spot right there. Probably about a three. Nice spot. We just got to the back of this little cove and seen some bait fish. You can actually see some right next to Ron's hip up there. But up here in like no inches of water, I threw the jerk bait up there and man, I bet if I pried open his mouth, I could probably pull some shad out. He is fat. Oh, oh, Look at there. That's what I was talking about. Right up here on the bank, I'm just seeing a ton of little bait fish just kind of scatter. And uh, sure enough, just caught a little thread fin. Talk about matching the hatch. Holy crap. Yeah. Look at that bait. Look at that. Look, Ron finally caught a fish. <laughs> Kid, yeah, there you go, matching the hatch. Tell me that ain't unbelievable. Yeah, it is. Little thread fin. I'll give you five dollars if you eat them. <laughs> <laughs> there he is, dude. Look at there. Freaking good one too. Yeah, another nice one. How about that? Pop off. <laughs> yeah, I tried to boat flip him, but how about that? Got him. Nice one? Yeah, it's a big one. Watch out. Hi, Tech. Better play the lottery. <laughs> Uh, uh, oh, that's full size. <laughs> On these fish back here, they're just in little clouds. And uh, God, the bait fish are so tiny, but that one fell victim to a jerk bait. Another solid, probably two and a half, a little better. I told my buddies over there, they're fishing too. I said, better play the lottery. It's been tough trying to catch these fish back here. Got him. Big him. 
go oh, it's a giant dude if he's not if he's not fouled it's a giant oh <laughs> he's fouled blown up there yeah got him you're like you wonder how many got him yep like a good one gone all right friends well that was a wrap had a lot of fun today we missed quite a few fish i think i missed five i missed three or four yeah that would put us that would put us uh probably in the low 20s as far as fish numbers but uh kind of a grind we caught them first thing uh throwing a jerk bait around some breaking fish that were eating herring and our jerk baits really matched the hatch and then we ended up catching a hundred fish technically snagging them <laughs> yeah the little shad in the back of the dang creek we just could not figure out how to get those fish to eat consistently they were eating i mean some of those threadfin were the size of my thumbnail i mean they were so little and those fish were really dialed in but i had fun gonna do it again gonna do it again i like fishing with this guy he's a stud <laughs> he's a stud anyways rolling out rolling out from Going lake home. chatoog see y'all thanks for watching